Hello guys, this is Asians Adventures and Travel. Ngayon naman ay uh, andito tayo sa Stratcona Science Park. Located din ito sa North Saskatchewan River Valley on both banks of the river. Ayan, and of course, it is being maintained by Alberta Tourism Parks and Recreation. This site was for thousands of years the site of an annual aboriginal camp as it was located close enough to the river for transportation and trade and the bluffs of the river valley provided excellent bison hunting opportunities. The park was established to preserve the site from encroaching industrial development. It was the site of archaeological excavations in 1978 to 1980. The park contains several abandoned interpretive buildings opened by the Alberta government in 1980 but not now shattered. Remnants of the park's history as a public science center include tiled triangular obelisk, a boardwalk through the archaeological area, and a few interpretive plaques. The area is safe but overgrown. May mga activities din pong ginaganap dito sa park like cross-country skiing, downhill skiing, front-country hiking, mountain biking, and toboganing. Kasama na din po dito ang radio-controlled aircraft. Tignan nyo guys yung building, parang ang design niya is like an UFO. Ayan. Diba? Parang UFO lang siya. The park has a number of walking trails, both paved and dirt, that offer beautiful views of the Edmonton cityscape and North Saskatchewan River. Mountain biking trails wind through the forest along the river, and the park connects to Roundel Park via long pedestrian bridge over the river. Large open grassy areas are perfect for a quick game of pickup football or soccer. It's a quick and easy escape from the city. Hindi po siya weekend today kaya wala pa po ako nakikitang tao dito sa area. And uh, tignan natin, ito gravel road po yung dinadaanan namin ngayon. At uh, may mga trails sa gilid. Masarap dito maglakad kasama ng ating mga pets. Ayan. Napakatahimik guys. Pero make sure po when you come here, please bring someone with you kasi hindi po siya safe kung mag-isa lang po kayo nakakatakot This short corner science park is the only provincial park in the River Valley Alliance Park System. Over the past century, this area has been home to a number of coal mines, a gravel extraction pit, and finally a landfill before becoming a provincial park in 1980. As part of Alberta's 75th anniversary in 1980, the Alberta Heritage Fund invested the equivalent of $40 million in today's dollars to create the park. Wow! $40 million, guys! Ang lacking amount. It consisted of six main buildings showcasing the area's rich history of settlement over 4,000 years. 
The buildings hosted displays of the different artifacts that were unearthed in the area. In the south end of the park, there is a wooden trail which was built in order for the public to observe archaeologists at work. Napapansin ninyo guys, there's a table and bench there pero wala siyang fire pit guys. Ayan. So, pwede kayo dyan umupo, relax relax, muni muni. Ayan, lakad tayo, punta tayo doon sa, tingnan natin kung ano meron doon sa dulo guys. Let's go! Ito guys, another building makikita natin dito. Kaparehas lang din ng isa. Magkasing hawig na magkasing hawig. At makikita nyo rin, ang damo ay hindi na siya namo. Masyadong mataas na siya guys. Ayan guys, may building ulit at kaparehas din ang nakita natin na una. Meron siya dito pa sa mga flag guys. It's a flagpole. Ayan. Currently, the park has been left as a natural area with the buildings closed to the public since 1993. Sunridge Ski Hill occupies the northernmost building and runs a small ski operation. In 1987, a tornado tore through the park, leaving a trail of destruction in the trees but left the building largely unharmed. The various paved and gravel trails which run through the park are in daily use and it is also a popular spot for pet owners. Bike groups, running clubs, and bird watchers are a common sight in the park. From various places around the park, you get fantastic views of the river valley and Rundell Park just across the river. There is a pedestrian bridge connecting the two parks. There are also a large number of picnic benches on this park. There is a drop in elevation as you drop into the park and a steady climb up the back side of the loop to the parking lot. However, there are plenty of paths back to the park where you can avoid the elevation chains if you need to. An enjoyable short walk where you can expect to encounter many types of birds and other walkers on the path. Ayan guys, yung mga upuan no, nakita nyo, tsaka may table. So marami dyan nagkalat sa loob ng park. And today, I don't uh, see anyone sitting on the bench. So, uh, medyo nakakatakot lang dahil naglalakad ako mag-isa, guys. Ayan, guys. Naglalakad po ako ngayon. Ayan. At uh, titignan natin kung ano pang meron dito sa, sa park na ito, sa Strathcona Park. Ayan, malungkot kasi <laughs> mangilan ilan lang po, dalawa lang yung nakita ko naglalakad kanina and so, ako mag-isa lang dahil uh, si Andre po ay uh, hindi po maganda ang pakiramdam ayan, may nakita ako nagbabike guys, ayan so, ayan, may nagbabike doon ayan, ni mama titignan ko kasi Over, overlooking siya dun sa kabilang park po guys and uh, ito oh parks naturally sabi niya this area planted in 1999 ayan so guys ayun overlooking makikita ninyo yung other side ng Randall Park and uh, yung river ng North Saskatchewan River 
medyo tingnan niyo yung daan guys medyo nakakatakot kasi mag isa lang ako pero kakayanin ko to kakayanin ko ito guys pero hindi na ako bababa doon uh, trail din to trail siya uy bakit ganito dito ayan guys so pakita ko sa inyo ah Bangin. Ayan oh. Parang tinangay ng ano, ng agos ng tubig. Ayan oh. And makikita nyo yung river. Medyo delik delikado. So balik ako doon sa daanan. Ayan guys. Ang makikita, di ba? Ayan. Ayan po. Yan. Yung building po na yun ay downtown na po. So, it's an opposite of the Rondel Park. Balik tayo dun, guys. <laughs> Ayan. Yan guys, hanggang dito lang muna tong video ito at may uh, part 2 po. So, pakihintay po yung part 2 and I hope guys that uh, you're gonna watch all my videos. Thank you very much for uh, watching and please subscribe sa aking channel kapag hindi pa po kayo nakasubscribe. At huwag po kalimutang uh, pindutin ang bell para lagi po kayong updated. Thank you so much and mabuhay po tayo lahat. Love, 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 love po. Bye for now.